If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. I thank you so much for your continuous support. If you are new here, please click on the subscribe button. So, guys, I am finally back. I am finally back. Um, it's been over a month. I thought I would take a month maximum. But I took over a month because things got hectic. But I in another vlog. I took a break because I wanted to go back to the drawing board. I wasn't happy with um, the content I was taking. I feel like I was recording for the sake of recording, you know, like it wasn't giving. I wasn't happy with the content I had, but I'm not going to delete them. I'm not going to delete them. When I think of this channel, I see it as my visual diary where I want to capture every moment of my life when i am excited about something happening in my life i can pick up the camera i can record it so that whenever whatever i can just go back to it and watch it even for my family my friends so that's how i see my channel but in as much as it's for my moments and whatever i see it as a visual diary i'm putting it here for people to see so it has to be What's the word? Palatable. Hoga to watch it like ibe ishebele man nobo, but for how you enjoy when they watch it. I just I shouldn't just record it in J or even more. Like I need people to enjoy it. Do you understand? I need people to take something from it. So feedback eke toting from the five first five videos I uploaded. Ne, I am very happy. I do not want to lie, and a lot of people showed support. But one of the people ne. That really stood out. A lot of people stood out for me, but there was always that one person who was always commenting. I remember from the time when Kineki got the question of Formerona for my Get to Know Me tag. She sent so many questions. Every video I post, she comments me and I was commenting on she believes she was something. I was commenting on like every video I comment on engagement. Like, that person stood out and she was a I am 
so grateful for that babes if you're watching this i know you'll be watching this so thank you so much for the support you showed me and everyone else like you know um uh was it last week i think it was last week oh yeah we have i got an inbox actually but like i won because but i was looking for this other message that someone said they sent but because i won inbox you so then i realized there's something called message requests on facebook so i went under the so i found that one and that person was like hi i saw you val morley i'm one of your subscribers i wanted to come and hug you you know you would expect such from people about Ziba, oh, yo, you're doing so great. What, 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 what. Even if it's hard oil, but more about Ziba, about DM or anything, oh, yo, you know, you know. But for someone that you do not know, someone that you don't have on socials, it's like next, next. Because when you see Facebook friend, yeah, guy, more about next, next. Now, when you start getting more like, you take someone to be, I haven't seen it like such an inbox. Oh, yo, guys. It means a lot and if she's watching that also please know that you are one of the people who keep me going well, well, you make me want to pick up the camera and record and thank you so much for that yeah, it means so much it means so much to me it means a lot so yeah the support was great it was great but i feel like there are people who do want to support support me who do want to support me but they don't know some things that would actually help me a lot for instance um not skipping parts of a video ne? so if we skip any parts before this please go back <laughs> and go rewatch them ne? because when you skip um my videos firstly it harms the watch hours if you know to be monetized on youtube you need four thousand watch hours and one thousand subscribers so if we skip it ha it harms the watch hours because i could have a video yeah 15 minutes and then because of skipping you've only watched for five minutes so it contributes very little to the watch hours please do not skip parts of this video if like a certain part is less interesting yeah maybe go later in 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 and then yeah we talk about skipping yeah and then now liking the videos ne? a like also helps with youtube recommending videos to people because now i don't know a lot of people i don't have great social media following you understand so so it relies a lot on recommendations because because you liked it and then okay algorithm or whatever yeah it's a the things if you do like i recommended on someone's youtube and then they come across my channel or not and also comments just like liking comments please so please like and comment even before watching the video please like <laughs> even if you don't like it please like and then okay this is um i think it's a big part it's an important part in it because i know a lot of people have an number wi-fi a lot of people have banner wi-fi they don't have access to wi-fi but would like to watch videos youtube it's not that expensive to watch a video i would buy rush hour um 300 megabytes mtn and i could watch a video yeah 25 to 30 minutes with that so if you don't have access to that you can buy rush hour it's cheap, you know, 300 megabytes or one gig gif if you close your little TV, just to watch this video because I know as well as I've been able to access it to Wi Fi. You know, my friend Bongi, Lena knows if said watch hour, I mean, <laughs> the rush hour to watch my videos. I don't like any more to watch my videos. I know that not only my videos but a lot of videos so you can um buy into them you know she will i see hey cool charge a little thing at the top of the top she will be doing that to support me and then subscribing subscribing is for free some people don't know that i've come to realize that some people don't know get my hello subscriber so please subscribe hi cool charge next I want to see the fella how whole so please do subscribe to my channel you can do that right now if you haven't done it please do subscribe <laughs> on that note thank you so much for your patience while i was gone i am back thank you for your support let's go in 
a whole lot of it I'm going to give me hair it's into the nice it's a lovely and then when I get to 500 subscribers I'm gonna celebrate it by buying a tripod because uncle won't have to be ready to run no record hello no call then that's all for her key holy when I leave you there's a cooler box here and I click a couch because I'm sitting on the couch there's a cooler box after cooler box he gave the box like DSTV killer in killer dish I think a love food give me a balance out for me got perfume at Danny Hill and he learned that he never do so that's how I set things up for now so when I get to 500 subscribers I'm gonna celebrate it by buying a tripod so that you okay. um I'm gonna show you a short um quick hair installation video i've already installed it so i'm gonna play it after this Libonorna. how do i install my hair a quick one and for beginners please for beginners eh? and a quick singing i are into detail or professional it's for beginners and about what that dealing and then after that um i'm going to go to the shops i need to buy some oxtail in yana lady what i can look at oxtail today so because i should i'll take you guys along i'm just gonna record myself and then after that i'll show you guys what i got up to i'll show you guys what i got up to and take it on my break So guys, I'll be installing this unit um, from Vogue Boutique. Um, I'm so bummed because I saw this other, what can I call it? Not a trick or a hack or whatever from Montadine. She went live on Facebook the other day and she showed us how she removes this glue from Mona Nanane. She uses surgical spirits. Um, I used to use this alcohol remove a thingy and then i ran out of it so i was like i'm gonna use my surgical spirit and then i found it but before i used it before i could use it actually i misplaced it so i can't find it and usually it will place a boy when i install it but yeah if you do have surgical spirits um please remove this wig please remove this glue with yeah. <laughs> Please remove this glue and also when I say this hello hook also I you know when you've installed it already and then you don't wanna remove it ham it would work the baby heads or how not not she dabbed it on got cotton woolly and then it was easier to remove the wig. So yeah, I'll be installing this. Um I already have my wig cap on. Some people go an extra mile, they go all out by by melt, eh, by eating, by eating, you know, like they take this, by it, uh, by glue, eh, by blow dry, by cut, eh, it's a the foundation, what, what, but I don't do that. So I just put this on to protect my hair and also for a hike in the week, you know, finally, like, it's a little brown, no, but I don't have the black hair. So I just put this under. So I'm going to start with this um, ghost bond glue i bought it at this other salon if you're from Valcom, i bought it at can i be done this other not salon this other shop i bought it there this is where i got mine but you can also buy it um on take a lot i'm not sure how much it is but finally on a take a lot and can show other stores that sell hair pc fiber Okay, 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 this alone they also have it man. So yeah, I use my finger for this so that I can have more control over when I get So I'm just gonna look at the mirror when I apply this. I hope I can apply it. But yeah, get us a saw. I could see get have a little work as but for now, I'm not gonna apply too much because so yeah. Basically, I apply this with my finger, Jinanana hair, and I blow dry it. 
hold it a bit transparent as you can see no jenna it's currently white you also don't need to blow dry it but it's much quicker how it's how you blow dry like head dry but i want to scan the reborn was in the color ever transparent here so i wait for it to be transparent and then get out of here give beige so when i'm in a hurry i go straight to this i just spray it on and then go for a second layer and let it dry and then i um lay my wig when i'm in a hurry and also when i know that maybe later on during the day i'm gonna remove the wig or something yeah when i don't need it to last for long because I, I can't sleep with my wig on i really struggle with that so yeah i just go with this get the two layers get the get done. but for now i just want to show you for but what like the last day I didn't apply a lot because but if you want to you can maybe go for another layer or apply more than I applied oh, so sometimes on top of this I spray this I like there are so many ways of doing it but for now let's go straight to putting this on Mm. guys i'm not going into detail because remember this is a quick hair installation so i'm not going into detail with everything and i'm not going all out because so it's just a quick what 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 <laughs> so yeah um okay Mm. Yeah. Ha -ha. Mm. Okay, let's do this and comb the hair back. Oh, get frustrated because I on this and I really wanted to remove it but I can't find the surgical spirit and I don't have time to oh yeah and then I'm gonna use my elastic elastic this elastic I also got from that shop like they have a and then they just cut a meter or something for you And it dirty. I tried to wash all this glue off, but it's not going off. But because it's it cheap, I'm gonna just buy another one and throw this one away. Learn it cheap in Twinana. You can also get it on Take a Lot. You can get it on Take a Lot, just like the Got to Be. No, not the Got to Be the Ghost Bond. So, can I hold your hands and your hands? Layer, I secure or whatever, but yeah, just for a few minutes, I leave this illichinana. But some people get a headache from this, they really don't like it. Same as me, like, I only put it for a few minutes, but it can cause you a headache, especially when it's tight. And I get over every tight, so that I know it. Okay, so some people now while they're waiting for it to lay and whatever, they prefer to straighten it. So mine, I think, is fine. I don't want to straighten it now. So some people highly generally while you're waiting for a few minutes or any, they will just go and straighten their hair and whatever. But yeah, I'm not gonna do that. It hasn't been long <laughs> since I laid this. Now, but because, like I said, get in is a it's not that deep so so guys um now i'm gonna spray this um glamour beauty spray i also bought it it was a hundred rand still has a price tag on it was a hundred rand but they also have it on take a lot and unfortunately i don't know how much it is 
Now, my challenge is that I think this thing is broken. So, when I spray, it goes on for a good little. Like, I don't know what happened to it. But yeah, I'm just gonna spray it on. I guess it will hit a lot more. Yeah, I'm not gonna apply a lot, but yeah, I play this. So, guys, I left this on for a few minutes like a very, very, very few minutes because I got a concrete on it. This is the part that I hate the most because these things that I'm using this year residue, so and especially because I didn't remove the glue that was already on the lace i didn't move it so it's a build up of glue so it leaves residue so this part i hate the most when my things are not in order but let's see <laughs> you see what i am talking about like this is all glue a and then build up you see uh, this thing but this is why I have this Isoplus um, spritz. I saw this on. Was it Homoza Ramano? I don't remember, but I saw this on someone's YouTube channel. I have spritz. So, um. Can you turn it away so untidy? Please be neat. But yeah, if you have um, surgical spirits or the alcohol remover that I was talking about, you can just also go on with it and just in front, not on the lace, just here where it's your skin. Oh yeah, it's a little bit of a because I see Monana and I have glue on my skin. But yeah, if you have the remover or the surgical spirits, so yeah, I can put your hair or your cotton wool or whatever to remove the Monana so that you can remove the bitchy thing on your skin. Because I wanna it how and then you go I bought this at clicks. I don't remember how much it was, but I got it at clicks. I spray on my finger, guys. Always use my finger for most things. For no, that's so wrong. Um for <laughs> and then I is it dab but yeah i do this so that it shines and if we could have the residue that will be left here but white ball but here so but don't put on too much because since it's it's it, um it's runny it's wet it can shift your lace because me it's like so it can be permitted glue and then it's just so don't put on a lot don't put on a lot for that part and then also some people would go on ganito hair with their foundation so that it blends well but because i'm not gonna apply makeup and whatnot i'm not gonna do that part but yeah you can go on with your foundation and dab it on or blend it into a hand that is how I install my frontals very quickly. That's my quick installation, my go-to installation in mornings when I'm in a hurry. But yeah, when I buy a new frontal wig, now I'll record a detailed video from where I cut my lace to what and what and what and what. So yeah, it's like for me and a fail. Wait into the speed and. Mm,
Still taking a break i went to the shooting range with my man um it wasn't my first time going to the shooting range actually so we went to the shooting range and i absolutely enjoyed it please when you get the chance to go by the shooting range in even if you don't have a gun some shooting range Rangers, some shooting rangers um actually have their own licensed guns that they can borrow you. And then they borrow you their um gun and they provide their own ammunition. Ammunition bullet. They provide you with all of that and then it's very nice. It's very nice, I don't wanna lie. how it's hard, please try it. Overcome your fears. You won't die. I didn't die. To give you late and it could really help as much as it's wholesome because yo, 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 especially the gun I used this time around. Yeah, yo, yo. What you get recoil or get? Get to really recoil. Now recoil is when the gun does that thing how to when you like it. That jump up, but good thing that oh, in another it's not classified as recoil because it's not that bad so i guess i'll probably turn a bit on but when i get to really recoil so you know it's maybe time on him that thing can i stress and the bullets come flying so you have to have a body in because i remember in wheel a shop of a moon and i'm like in the end you think it's on like it's on camera because you know i get out to me and then there's a part a jump on yeah that part is jump on back i jump pick a mother but so sorry, I jump big a but yeah. To do just for that, this is about it's fun, it's fun, adrenaline rushing, and I also please try it. And um, yeah, this is how it went down. It's 
but you just look, squeeze, 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 squeeze. You're pulling your gun to your left. Just squeeze the trigger slowly. <laughs> Target and you're more to the to the level. So you <laughs> but remember, if you shoot and you tire, you can either rest your and go up for another two shots and rest, or put your gun down, rest, relax, take it again. Okay. Magazine is uh, hollow points, uh -huh. and then they put another magazine of normal rounds. Okay. Want to, but I'm, I don't know. Like targets, take it, take a photo. Okay. I can't remember what's the date. You, you, you did take a picture of the. Okay. Mm. But I'll keep this one that day. Yeah. Just write the date and write your names on it. Okay. Yeah, I like we took a video on that day, so we'll just see when. Yeah, just video. check, yeah. Yeah. But 15. That's occasional sport. Now, for the occasional sport. Yeah. This is probably going to be the longest vlog I've ever had. So let me wrap it up here. I am back. Thank you so much for your patience once again while I was gone. And please do stay tuned. We get like a content here. Lovely. And I'll see you guys on the next one.